What's going on YouTube? I was gonna save this for the daytime, but I figured I'd go ahead and uh go ahead and let y'all know what's going on. My eyes is all glazed over. I've been up all day working on this thing. There's something in the woods. Don't know what it is, but yeah, I look really I'm really tired. Well I'm not really tired, my eyes just really got a problem. But anyways, just got done cranking this thing up. I feel good about it. Man, y'all know how happy I am to get this thing running. Ran into a couple of little problems. Right now, like right now, it's just uh, everything in the front's all good to go, but I got the uh, fuel pump, fuel pump wire, fuel pump uh, wires running. Like I said, I mean, as you can see, I ain't got it ain't it ain't ready to run on the street yet so the way i got the back i just got a piece like some ground wires from the fuel pump riding to the trunk they're just hanging out the back i was dying to get this thing cranked up but it worked out so i mean that bad boy's running i'll give you all the fire up in a minute like i said uh i might not be able to talk right because like i said i'm i need to get some sleep I've been out here trying to track down a couple problems. Uh, kept idling high, idling low. I got the little Torque Torque Pro app with the OBD2 uh, adapter, so it was giving me all these readings. Uh, at first, uh, I thought the transmission was bad, but uh, all it needed was another gal gallon of transmission fluid. It was real low, so as soon as as soon as it got topped up with transmission fluid, it uh, went through all the gears, reverse, and drive, and all that. And then after I got that done, uh, smelled gas all through the car. I forgot to uh, tighten up those compression fittings. You gotta really crank them down. So uh, that's what I went ahead and did. That's good, no leaks for the, uh, from the uh, fuel pump. And then, let me see, the engine was uh, climbing up pretty high. Got it like 220, 230. And I was like, why in the hell is this doing this? And then uh, I ain't got the electric fans ran yet. Like I said, I was just gonna crank it up, see how it does. <clears throat> what I'm talking about? Can't remember. But let's uh walk over here. It's a mess out here. Like I said, the uh, cold intake intake works. It uh for me mounting the uh, air filter right there on the front, dropped it down about 20, 25 degrees. It's running 86 on the intake air. 86 degrees. So it's running pretty cold. And uh, let me see. Oh yeah, back to the coolant thing. I had added it into the radiator. And then, uh, let me see, I added about a gallon. I figured that was enough, but apparently not. This thing was bone dry. So, I'm trying to figure out why I thought the water pump might have been bad. But all I did was uh, pull, I was noticing uh, the upper radiator hose. So I got, I got it tucked up under the uh, cold air intake. But um, wasn't getting hot. All the all the radiator hoses it was all was all cold. Let's see. Let me show y'all where I'm at. That's where I'm getting creaked out out here. I thought that was a zombie. Too much Walking Dead. What was I talking about? I gotta. I, I swear I gotta give me a better setup on a camera. I'm using an old Droid phone. What I talking about? I said I'm out of. Uh, yeah, I just uh, went ahead and pulled the uh, upper hose off of here, off the water pump, and filled directly into uh, the water pump. Filled that up till it overflowed out, and then I filled up the hose with fluid, with coolant. And then once I done that, she started uh, cooling down a little bit, opened up the thermostat. So, we'll see how that does. Hopefully I ain't got to get on water pump or nothing. I, I didn't try to take apart the engine too much well that's all good uh for the transmission i got i, I got the i got a chrome oil pan on it with a drain plug and i got the one two solenoid and three four solenoid in it with the filter deep pan in it that's what i got that's something that you can't see right now what else um like i said batteries in the trunk it's starting up pretty good if we didn't want to start because the uh, my battery, one the actual battery I got running in here, the Optima, it was uh, 
it was like 11 volts, 10, 10, 10 11 volts. It was, it was about dead. And uh, it didn't have enough to kickstart the, uh, the computer. So I had another one I had, uh, another battery I had charging for another car. Threw that on there, she fired right up. I swear, y'all dying to see that, I forgot. Like, I've been running this thing all night, just trying to track everything down. But let me give y'all, wait, what was I talking about? I have lost my mind. Y'all gotta bear with me, like, I'm happy. Like, this is like three, almost a little over three years trying to get this thing running. And I finally got it running. So, I mean, patience. And perseverance you gotta be with it like i said I, I, I felt like giving up on it but now that uh this bad boy running i'm happy like i said i'm gonna have i'm gonna have a good old dreams not when i go to sleep and drag racing into something i don't know like i said i can right now it's gonna be a daily i'm gonna see how it is and then uh you know if, if everything goes good money comes in pretty good I may take it to the track. I don't know. I may take it to the track. I don't know. I mean, oh wait, I forgot to tell y'all. I got a, I got a bunch of stuff to tell y'all. Like it's, it's ridiculous. I ran the 77 at the track. Uh, I'll, I'll post in. Uh, I, I can actually do some editing now because uh, summer semester's out. So um, I put that up. I got a couple of uh, drag racing videos of uh, other cars. But I ran the 77. I did like a 68 and an eighth. Um, you see, my time was like 11, 11 something. I I don't know. I went ahead and just done it. Me and my buddy had raced heat, and we uh, went head to head in this C10. He whooped me. But uh, yeah. Let me uh, let me go ahead and fire this thing up real quick and uh try to get this video out. And um, I'm running premium in it. I don't know why I even said that. I mean. I don't know. I'm wearing shoes. I don't know. I'm stupid. I, I just need to like, just, ah, I don't know. Ah, I can barely speak English. All right, here we go. Get the thing lit up. Uh, got a little LED light up there. I don't really like it. It ain't, it ain't as bright as a, I swear that damn thing back here jiggling, man, or j dangling. Scared the hell out of me. I thought it was a big ass spider. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, are y'all ready? Are y'all ready? Here we go. A one, a two, a one, two, three, four. Well, what the fuck? Oh, I didn't let the uh, fuel, fuel pump prime. All right, it's gonna crank up this time. Hallelujah. Well, what the fuck? There we go. Like I said, I think the battery, I've been killing the hell out of the battery. It ain't been charging. I've been cranking it up. But there we go right there, boy. There we go right there. Right now it's an open header. But, I'm like a big ass truck. Got the see. It's all going good. It's gonna be one of my awkward ass videos. I don't know. It's, yeah, she running good. Uh, she was smoking for a little while when I first cranked her up. All that oil and grease and stuff, all them headers. But she running good, man. She running good, real good. Oh yeah, real damn good. I swear, man. God, I mean, if you can do your own work bask in its own glory that you did it yourself I mean it feels so good I mean I mean you accomplished something I mean I mean it may be simple to some people but I mean it's a good accomplishment I say it's one of the uh, one of the best one of the biggest things I've accomplished so far next thing I'm, I'm hope hopefully I can graduate with my associates in uh, automotive mechanics, and then uh, you know, you get on the pathway, you know, living a bigger, bigger and better dream. You know what I'm saying? Sorry to get all mushy, but I mean, it runs. 
I don't know what I'm talking about. It's a long ass video. But yeah, she running. Got the cold air intake on. It might have been. That's my. That might be the thing that's uh, not making it wrong. Want to want to run? But like I said, the battery could be dead. She running good now. Before the idle was uh, kind of sporadic, and now the coolant's good. I guess everything was uh breathing hot, and it was trying to control stuff. And where I had the air filter on, I just had the air filter stuck on the uh, throttle body. And once I got this, it's all kind of on a control situation. But that is it. And I don't even know why the hell I'm still wearing the damn light on my head. But all right, y'all. Y'all take it easy. Y'all keep doing what y'all doing. Let's get these Chevys on the road. I ain't got no other quote. All right, y'all. Y'all take it easy.